I think for me, Burnley will be a good, good, very good team for now. So thanks for me, it's perfect to, to come to Burnley and progress more step by step, yeah. David, a warm welcome to Burnley. It seems to have happened so quickly. Yeah. How are you feeling right now? I feel uh, good, very good, and happy also to be here. Yeah. How did you find out about coming here? What were your thoughts when you did find out? Uh, you know, first I know Berlin, Berlin for a long time uh, because they play uh, first uh, Premier League before. And also I was this this champions and yeah, this league is my is my league, so I I know really well uh, Berlin and uh, everything. So yeah. So I know, as you've said, you know a little bit about Burnley. Yeah. But because I mean you're a good player, obviously yeah. you yeah. score good goals, obviously. <laughs> yeah. So why did you choose Burnley? Because uh, I think uh, Burnley for me is a, it will be a good team to me for progress and also Vincent Company. I know him also, and I saw some couple games, games of him. And uh, I think for me, Burnley will be a good, good, very good team. And also, thanks for me, it's perfect to, to come to Burnley and progress more step by step. Yeah. So, what can you tell us about you in terms of you as a player? How would you describe yourself? <sighs> and don't be modest. No, 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 no. Me, I can say I'm like. Funny guys, and I'm. I'm also someone who, I'm also lazy, sometimes not not every time. Also off the pitch off rather the, than off on. The, We're the talking the about no, you as a pitch, person no, now. Off the, off the pitch, lazy, yeah. but on the pitch I'm uh, someone who work hard, and also uh, uh, good atmosphere with the uh, good vibes also with the uh, with the team. I'm not shy, and then yeah. And yeah. when you're on the pitch. You've obviously got a lot of skills in those boots. I've seen some of your yeah, goals. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How much do you enjoy the, the whole goal scoring that you do? Do you, do you like the more flamboyant goals? What, how would you describe yourself as a striker? Uh, for me, uh, uh, for me uh, in the pitch is more dribblings, show everything, work hard and then yeah, score goals. Yeah. You mentioned a couple of times already about you wanting to learn and be better and yeah. that's what they do here mm -hmm. they, they bring someone in and they if they do leave yeah. or players that are here now they become better players and, and, and quite quickly yeah. as well so in terms of before you've come here first of all and the few times that you did play in the Premier League yeah. with Chelsea what, what did you learn in, in that experience of playing uh, in the Premier League with Chelsea um, first uh, they have a lot of good players and also big players. So even if I don't, I didn't play uh, with the, the games, I was uh, learning uh, a lot, much because we play, we play, we we train with uh, Thiago Silva, Rich James, and everything. They really know uh, the the league, the Premier League. So yeah, I learned uh, very very much with them, and also yeah with the with the coach Lampard. He was a Lampard and uh, also a great great player. And yeah, for me it was it was good to to train also because I I learn a lot of uh, like a lot of movement, a lot of think about the Premier League, you know. So for me it was perfect to yeah to to was there. Do, do you watch a lot of Premier League football? Yeah, only world, only only Premier League. Yeah, yeah. Who would be players that you that you look up to? So who would be the players in the Premier League historically that you would go, yeah, they are the, the no. goals? Both, as a Both. kid, as a, as a child, first uh, of all. For me, it was, uh, they have a lot, but for me, in my head, it was like, first Drogba, it was a great, great, great. And also Rooney, and when Rooney, and then, yeah, I think I would say Balotelli, but, <laughs> but Balotelli also, it was perfect, it was good. He do well uh, in, uh, in uh, Manchester City, and also I would say like um, Mosala. Mosala also is good. Mosala and Aland. So with Didier Drogba, yeah, obviously yeah. with him being Ivory Coast as well, was would he have been your inspiration? Maybe someone that you really looked up to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I really looked at him because uh, he's a good, 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 really good striker, and also uh, like he's like. Uh, you know the best in our coast, 
and then yeah, everybody want to look look uh, look at him. So everybody want to be like him. But yeah, we try to to do to do something uh, like him and be uh, become also uh, the big player of Premier League. Yeah. You obviously you went to Germany for a mm. while, Bundesliga. Did that feel very different yeah. to Premier League? So what did you learn there? I, uh, I learned not so much because there is very, very tough. It's mm. only run, 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 run. You have to run, 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 run. If you don't do it, you have to to pay all, everything, you know. But I, I learned also something there. Yeah. yeah. So in terms of that, of all that running, are you ready to go? Are you fit and ready to get out there? Always, always ready, yeah. So just finally, you're now a Burnley player, number 23. Yeah. You're new. Was there a reason? Do you know who had that previously here? Who? Do you know the, pre the, the, foot, the player before you who was number 23? No. was Nathan Teller. Ah. Uh, yeah. Really? So, big shoes to fill. Yeah. Yeah, but a good number. Did you good pick number. it? Everybody said this. Yeah, uh, yeah. but that's good Everybody though, right? It's good. Yeah, it's good because I was a physio. She said uh, it's twenty-three. Yes, yeah, good, good, good number. I said, why you said it's good? She said, no worries. So, did you just pick it because it was available, or did you? Because I'm thinking David Beckham. Yeah. I'm thinking Michael Jordan. Yeah. If you're a basketball yes, fan. Yeah, yeah. Jamie Carragher, some would say mm. as well. Nathan Teller here as well. Yeah, so, do yeah. you, do you like that challenge? So, what did you yeah. see it and think I can do number yeah, twenty three? I like, I like, I like this challenge. Yeah, I like. I think you've got it in you as well to, to rise to that. Yeah. Just right. finally, because I know you've still got lots to do mm. here to get yourself to be a full time, one hundred percent Burnley yeah. man. A lot of people, not just in Burnley, not just in England, but around the world who will be wishing you all the very best. Thank you. Burnley fans everywhere you everywhere, go. Yeah. Have you got a message for them? Uh, yeah, a little bit, thanks for them. Uh, hey, hello uh, fans, I'm David Atrofofana. I'm happy to be here and let's see on the pitch, yeah. I get the impression you're very excited yeah. right now. Yeah, I'm excited. Yeah. Good, very good luck, all Thank the very you. best. I'm sure Thank you'll be you. wonderful here. And what you now have to say is up the clarets. So now when you talk about Burnley, up the clarets. Up the clarets. Yeah, there you go. That's good. That's good.